Ladies and gentlemen, uh, our guest this evening is Mr Stuart Marcus uh, and I've been looking forward to this gig for weeks because he's got the most wonderful voice, a really yeah, yeah. terrific range of songs. So I'm not going to waste any more time, ladies and gentlemen, Stuart Marcus. Woo! Thank you. Thank you. I was afraid my ego would get uh, too big as it was, so <laughs> thank you. Uh, this is one, let's see, well, I wrote this one a few years ago when I uh, found myself falling in love, kind of realized I was, and I was having this conversation with myself and this realization as I was binge watching the Lord of the Rings trilogy on cable TV. So the two kind of uh, converged on me, and this is sort of my take on Skiffle, which is the, the British take on American blues. It's called The Highest Walls Guard the Greatest Treasure. Behind the castle walls of brick and stone, a treasure lies known but to you alone. Past a creek there and wooden door, velvet chair and a flagstone floor, a dragon's lair and an iron hinge is grown. Thus I press on, inch by measure, for the highest walls guard the greatest treasure. With every step I hear the cautious word, only a fool pursues the singing sword. Guarded by the darkest night, you have slain her foe in every fight. Your final light is all you're heading toward. But the greatest of risks bring the greatest pleasure. For the highest walls guard the greatest treasure. are set on high, the parapets abrade the sky, a portcullis and a bluff that overlooks the sea to fend a heart that won't be taken easily. said fools rushing where angels fear to tread and though it's true that gold and jewels are coveted by thieves and fools my aim is to a higher purpose led and thus i press on inch by measure for the highest walls guard the greatest treasure Highest walls guard the greatest treasure. The highest walls guard the greatest treasure. The highest walls guard the greatest treasure. Ah, good to see. Some of the people who are chiming in. I, pre I appreciate the, uh, the the forgiving attitude. Uh, so uh, as you can tell from the the painting behind me, I uh, I like all sorts of things nautical, uh, including nautical music, and uh, I have a sideline singing sea shanties, which uh, to, to my great pleasure have all of a sudden become the hot thing on TikTok. <laughs> which uh, I always say, folk music goes in and out of fashion, and you never quite know what's going to trigger it. So this is one I wrote, uh, oh boy, probably about over 15 years ago. It was when the book The Perfect Storm came out, or when the movie came out, actually. I heard about the book and 
wrote this a little too late to try to get it into the movie, not that I've known how anyways, but uh, in the fashion of a, a maritime ballad, this is one I wrote about that called Gloucester Ladies. When the seas are calm and the sky is fair and the winds are light and warm, it's hard to picture in your mind what it's like at the height of a storm. But seas can change and winds grow foul and hurl a ship a leak. And the Gloucester ladies wait and pray for the men to return from the sea. For hundred years the men set out the Grand Banks for to ply With one eye on the fishing rig, the other toward the sky For the sudden storm is such the norm with great ferocity and Foster ladies, wait and pray for the men to return from the sea. Ten thousand men set sail again in good ships, taut and free. And the Gloucester ladies, wait and pray for the men to return from the sea. A pitch pole waves strikes from the head, a broaching sea from the side. Her bow gets buried in the trough, and the crew end up in the tide. So many men not seen again, God bless their family. And the Gloucester ladies wait and pray for the men to return from the sea. Ten thousand men set sail again in good shapes, taut and free. And the Gloucester ladies wait and pray for the men to return from the sea. The old church hall there stands a wall, ten thousand names upon. For every man who worked the sea and disappeared thereon, and every one a mother's son, a sweetheart or a friend. But a watery grave is all they have, no resting place to tend. Ten thousand men set sail again, in good ships taut and free. And the Gloucester ladies wait and pray for their men to return from the sea. Ten thousand Set sail again in good ships, taut and free. And the Gloucester ladies wait and pray for the men to return from the sea. Uh, a, uh, an unusually snowy winter here in New York and Long Island. We, we have them every once in a while. Um, and it was during one such winter a bunch of years ago that I uh, decided to play a really nasty joke on a sea shanty. 
So if y'all feel like singing along, this one's called Holloway Snow. The storm that came the other day came on with great ferocity. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Uh, uh, <laughs> to to groan of twas a shovel and pain to kids a curiosity. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will all haul together. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will haul for better weather. Way haul away, will haul away snow. And you all, of course, are welcome to sing along from the comforts of your home. It closed the southern park way down from Islip to Cross Island. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Some folks stayed to stick it out while some fled to the highlands. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will all haul together. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will haul for better weather. Way haul away, will haul away snow. A snowflake is a dainty thing until they all gang up on you. Way haul away, will haul away snow. So better shovel early before they get the drop on you. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will all haul together. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will haul for better weather. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Now way upstate some like to ski while others like their sledding. Way haul away, will haul away snow. But in New York they spend the storm all huddled in their bedding. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will all haul together. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will haul for better weather. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Now in New York and in Rochester, a foot of snow will barely get them humming. Way haul away, will haul away snow. But here they raid the stores as if the next great flood were coming. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will all haul together. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Way haul away, will haul for better weather. Way haul away, will haul away snow. Hey, well, I'm, I'm going to the chat box because I'm trying to keep myself from uh, from from looking at it and reading what people are posting, and then I get distracted by it. <laughs> That's <part of> the <laughs> problem. So I am from Rochester, New York, and uh, and uh, we're, we're we're used to snowy winters. And uh, down here, people ask, "How could you stand the winters up there?" And uh, well, basically, you know, I say, yeah, it's colder, but I prefer a cold snowy day to a slightly less cold rainy one. And this is, this is one that I, I wrote a bunch of years ago that's typical of uh, the winter days down here. It's called a stormy winter Sunday afternoon. And it, uh, it's about a, a true story. I had a steady Sunday afternoon gig at a, a place about... Uh, 20 minutes away from me and this one particular Sunday it was just teeming out and I knew I better leave myself plenty of extra time to get there and, and sure enough every time I came to the bottom of the hill on the expressway um, there was a, a pond with cars stalled out that had tried to get through it too fast but uh, I made it there in time very proud of myself for being so professional and the owner of the place looked at me like I had two heads and said what are you doing here you should have called no one's gonna come in today and I hung out, read the paper, had a cup of coffee, and sure enough, not a soul walked in the place. So I set out home and figured, well, maybe the day shouldn't be a total loss. Maybe I can get a song out of it. And that's this one. Stormy winter Sunday afternoon The parkways all are flooding 
streams are overrunning, and mom say don't go out, you'll catch a cold. And only four by fours are on the road. It's time to start a lyric and a tune. Kick back from the madness, soothe the winter sadness, call some friends and cousins out of town. Revel in the time to just slow down No need for regretting the gig I couldn't play No one there to sing to, so I'll play another day I made it home through river streets that swallowed bigger cars And even snapped a picture on the way The kids upstairs are restless, I can tell Cat is happy sleeping, a cup of tea is steeping, I take a sip and jot a line or two, and think about a girl that I once knew. Say that it should let up in a couple hours more Perhaps then I'll head out to grab a few things from the store But just for now I'm happy reading in an easy chair And wouldn't want to venture out the door There's cleaning to be done, but what the hell A fireplace would be awesome Next place has to have one For now I'll veg out watching a cartoon Enjoy my stormy Sunday afternoon Very nice Yeah, very good Going to March and spring is in the offing. This is a, a song I like to, to pull out by uh, a band who I think now that uh, all of their work is over 50 years old, I think has entered the, the realm of folk music. Um, especially now that there are like three generations of people singing and recognizing their songs. comes the sun, doo -doo -doo -doo. here comes the sun, and I say, it's all right. Little darling, it's been a long, cold, lonely winter. Little darling, it seems like years since it's been clear. Here comes the sun, doo -doo -doo -doo. here comes the sun, and I say, it's all right. Little darling, the smiles are turning to their faces. Little darling, it seems like years since it's been here. Here comes the sun, doo -doo -doo -doo. here comes the sun, and I say, it's all right. Sun, 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 here it comes. Sun, sun, sun. I 
ice is slowly melting Little darling, it seems like years since it's been clear Here comes the sun, here comes the sun And I say, it's alright It's interesting to, to think now that, that the Beatles songs are as old now as uh, 1920s jazz was in the 1970s. <laughs> and yet it holds up extremely well. There's another one that, uh, that I wrote. Oops. I was at a, a folk music conference some years ago and, and uh, sitting on a showcase and realized I wasn't watching the band that was on stage but staring at uh, the back of the head of the wound in front of me who I later became very good friends with <laughs> nothing more than that please forgive me if I stare Polite and I apologize, but the ringlets in your hair proved a bit too tempting for my eyes. And as I sit behind you, I just had to take that chance. I knew I never could be satisfied with just one glance. Now you have caught me, and before this awkward moment's gone, I hope you'll somehow tell me, linger on. Please forgive me if I smile. One of my most twisted, tongue-tied grins That's not usually my style As the conversation just begins And I may start to stammer as I cast for words to say Between the old and low and have a truly awesome day Caught in the headlights and before this awkward moment's gone I hope you'll somehow tell me, linger on your body might feel next to me as the sunrise starts to stream through the cottage curtains by the sea it's only been one evening and this restaurant's first rate in a moment I may ask you for a second date but on this flight of fancy on this warm imaginary dawn I hope you'll somehow tell me Linger on
Thank you. Well, I know. Well. Keeping in the spirit of March with St. Patrick's Day just two weeks away. Not even. Um, I'll tell a, a little story. This is a song that uh, I pulled out when, uh, when my band, which is called Gathering Time, toured in Ireland about uh, three years ago. And uh, in fact, that's where I got this hat. That's why it has a little shamrock on it. Um, but I, I told the story that led up to this song. Um, 20 plus years ago, I, I tried my hand at real estate, doing apartment rentals and such. And I worked at a, a lovely agency. I didn't make a whole lot of money, but uh, it was you know, very nice people. But it was, uh, I worked with uh, an older woman named Kathleen Quinn. And uh, she'd heard me sing, and she was telling me about the Irish tenors, which were new and, and big at the time. And then she looked at me and said, Stu, you're an Irish tenor. And I said, oh, well, thank you very much. It's very nice of you to say. Actually, I, I am more of a baritone, and, and I'm Eastern European Jewish. And she looked at me and she said, you're an Irish tenor trapped in the body of a Jewish baritone. So. I was thinking of that conversation when uh, this song started coming to me. I had uh, a gig some years later at a, a country club playing cover songs, and I heard a, a couple people walk by. That's the thing when you're when you're playing background music, people forget that you're there. And I've been privy to some incredible intimate conversations that I had absolutely no business <laughs> being in on, but uh, they were right next to me. Um, but uh, in this case, these two guys were just uh, talking about the, uh, the, the comparative merits of their SUVs, and, uh, and this song popped into my head. I drove the Range Rover for many a year It was hard on the gas, but a pleasure to steer But now the stock market has crashed through the floor and I never will drive the Range Rover no more And it's no name never No name never no more Will I drive the Range Rover No never no more Hope some of you are doing the clapping part at home I went to a dealer I used to frequent and I told him that all of my lease miles were spent. He looked at my credit and said to me, Nay, because half of my net worth had melted away, and it's no nay never. No nay never, no more will I try the Range Rover. No never. Pulled from my pocket a gold card so bright And the dealer man's eyes opened wide with delight But when he ran it through like so oft times before Sir, you're over the limit And he showed me the door And it's no name never No name never no more Will I try the Range Rover no, never, no more I went to my parents, confessed my lost wealth And they said, no, so long as you still got your health And the next thing I'm going to put in my garage Is a Chevy a Nissan or maybe a Dodge and it's no they never no they never no more will I drive the Range Rover no never no more and it's no they never no they never no more will I drive the Range Rover
gonna think that I got time for one more song to do. So uh, I'll do. Uh, I'll do uh, Brilliant, Stuart. What's that? Brilliant, Stuart. Thank you. Oh, thank you, thank you. And I think I'm gonna come back like for another ten minutes a little bit later. I on. think so. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm gonna do this one then that uh, I wrote about three years ago in the. Uh, Actually, almost four years ago, well, three, three and a half years ago, in the early days of our, our most recent past presidential administration, and uh, I, uh, I foresaw that uh, a whole lot of hate groups would start to feel empowered to come out from under their rocks by the things he was saying and the way he was acting, and uh, turned out to be right. So this is one that uh, I recorded with my band Gathering Time also, and. Uh, and it uh, became a hit on uh, on folk radio, which is kind of cool, and uh, it's gotten a, a very good reception on these sort of things. And uh, I'm hoping that uh, now the message uh, will be heard. It, it harkens back to the times that America did stand on the side of of what's good and what's right, what's generally considered good and right by most people, most good people. It's called "Too Far to Turn Back Now." At the wilderness, General Grant, he cried At all the gallant men who died And he cast his eyes at a thousand graves In the great war to free the slaves But he rose and made a vow We've come too far to turn back now won't turn back now, won't turn back now We've come too far to turn back now After the ardent Eisenhower paused And all the sacrifice it caused Nineteen thousand men, half a million more To end a genocidal war but his task was planning how we come too far to turn back now. Won't turn back now, won't turn back now. We've come too far to turn back now. In every age there's a fight for freedom and for right. As people rise to say, you can't take these away. Down in Birmingham and in Washington And the places rights were slowly won Martin Luther King and many others killed See the dream of America fulfilled Songs of hope they did and down We've come too far to turn back now won't turn back now, won't turn back now We've come too far to turn back now Each time again we see that freedom isn't free And must defend zealously human rights and liberty Now we watch with dread, though we thought it dead Thoughtless hatred rears its head As the good book warns in words so sage Each generation, every age We must renew our sacred vow We've come too far to turn back now Won't turn back now, won't turn back now Far to turn back now. Won't turn back now. Won't turn back now. We've come too far to turn back now. Absolutely brilliant. Well done. Great set. Thank you. Well, if I got time for two more, I'll do do this one. It's the the most recent song that I wrote. I wrote it on uh, Martin Luther King Day here in the States. 
and of course February was uh, Black History Month and uh, this song refers to the fact that back in the days of sail crews tend to be quite mixed uh, culturally from various lands and uh, and it was one of the few equal opportunity industries for for black men as well not that they were that high-minded it was just that they were always hard up for crew and they didn't pay very well so if a man was willing to do the work for what they were willing to pay they didn't quibble uh, just a historic note the term black jack was commonly used back then it was not a, a derisive term at all so you'll hear that this is called when black hands saved me from the blue and i'm sure it is a true story although not one that i witnessed was a dark and a stormy curse of a day in November of late 92. And my soul was awoke in a terrible way when Black Hand saved me from the blue, brave boys. When Black Hand saved me from the blue. My shipmates had come from a bevy of lands. They called us a checkerboard crew. And half of their words I could scarce understand When Black Hand saved me from the blue, brave boys When Black Hand saved me from the blue Now the Black Hands had tended, the Black Jacks had tended to keep to themselves As most of us tended to do The French and the Irish and Yankees as well when Black Hand saved me from the blue, brave boys, when Black Hand saved me from the blue. But little it mattered when hauling a line, a halyard, a brace, or a clue. And mattered it less when aloft we did climb, when Black Hand saved me from the blue, brave boys, when Black Hand saved me from the blue. Twas on the main royal my hand lost its grip In a moment I ever shall rue From the wobbling foot rope I started to slip When Black Hand saved me from the blue Brave boys, when Black Hand saved me from the blue Tis many a sailor his end he has found And many good men overthrew at thirty degrees, first you freeze, then you drown. When Black Hand saved me from the blue, brave boys. When Black Hand saved me from the blue. But then a great strong hand gripped my arm up tight, with a strength such as I never knew. I looked up and saw a face dark as the night. When Black Hand saved me from the blue, brave boys. Black Hand saved me from the blue I think I shall mess with the Black Jacks today It seems like the least I could do For when facing the end shallow things melt away As when Black Hand saved me from the blue Brave boys, when Black Hand saved me from the blue I'd like to thank uh, Pete and everybody from the Northwich Folk Club. This has been an awful lot of fun. And uh, everybody who's tuning in, certainly everybody who has tipped me. I checked my email surreptitiously before. And saw a lot of deposits for $6.59, which I take it is probably five pounds after the exchange rate and minus uh, whatever uh, PayPal takes away. But I uh, uh, appreciate it all very much. And, and uh, for my Long Island uh, friends who are tuning in, I, I appreciate that also. Soon, hopefully, we'll all be back to work. Or gigs, as it were. Uh, you know what, for the last song, why don't I do this one? If th this is the very last song of the sing? Uh, if, if so, I will, uh, I'll do one that's the, traditionally the last chanty song on board a ship. It was used when warping a ship into the pier, that is, running a line from the pier head, you know, either throwing it or rowing it out to the pier head and then putting it around the capstan, sort of winding the ship in. And this is called Leave Her Johnny. And it's the last chance the sailors had to do some good griping about conditions. Oh, the times were hard and the wages were low. 
Leave her, Johnny, leave her, and now once more ashore we'll go, and it's time for us to leave her. Leave her, Johnny, leave her, oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her, for the voyage is done and the winds don't blow, and it's time for us to leave her. She would not wear and she would not stay. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. She shipped great seas both night and day, and it's time for us to leave her. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. Oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her. For the voyage is done and the winds don't blow, and it's time for us to leave her. It was rotten meat and weevily bread. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. It's eat or starve, the old man said, and it's time for us to leave her. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. Oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her, for the voyage is done and the winds don't blow, and it's time for us to leave her. Oh, the winds were foul and the work was hard. Leave her, Johnny, leave her, from the Liverpool dock to the Brooklyn yard, and it's time for us to leave her. Leave her, Johnny, leave her, oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her, for the voyage is done and the winds don't blow, and it's time for us to leave her. And I thought I heard the old man say, leave her, Johnny, leave her, Tomorrow you will get your pay, and it's time for us to leave her. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. Oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her. For the voyage is done and the winds don't blow, and it's time for us to leave her. And I hope tomorrow we'll get paid. Leave her, Johnny, leave her, cause it's been so long since I got drunk, and it's time for us to leave her. Leave her, Johnny, leave her, oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her, for the voyage is done and the winds don't blow, and it's time for us to leave her. And now it's time to say goodbye. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. The old beer head is drawing nigh, and it's time for us to leave her. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. Oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her. For the voyage is done and the winds don't blow, and it's time for us to leave her. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. Oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her. For the voyage is done and the winds don't blow, and it's time for us to leave her. Can you do us another one? Encore! Go back to the other side of the pond. This song also was actually written as a civil rights song. Just a very subtle one, so not everybody knows that. Blackbird singing the dead of night Take these broken wings and learn to fly All your life You were only waiting for this moment to arise Blackbird 
blackbird singing in the dead of night. Take these sunken eyes and learn to see all your life. You were only waiting for this moment to be free. Blackbird fly. Black In the light of the dark black night Black bird fly To the light of the dark black night Blackbirds singing in the dead of night Take these broken wings and learn to fly All your life Waiting for this moment to arise. You were only waiting for this moment to arise. You were only waiting for this moment to arise. Hey,